everyone, Miss Carrie here from Miss Carrie's Creations. Today I'm going to show you how to alter an SVG image using the contour tool. These five minute Cricut classes are designed for those of you who only have five minutes to learn how to use your Cricut. If you enjoy my five minute Cricut classes, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the thumbs up icon. Let's head into Cricut Design Space. There are so many SVG designs out there that you can upload into Cricut Design Space, but there are times that you want to alter the design. There are a few tools out there that will help you alter an SVG, but today we're going to take a look at single layer SVGs and how you can use the contour tool to modify the image. When you upload an SVG into Design Space, they can be single layer or multi layer images. Multi layer images are easy to modify because you can simply delete the portions of the design you don't want in that layers panel. In my Cricut Basics class, I go into more detail about the different uploads available, but since we only have five minutes, I'm just going to share one type of SVG today. Single layer images require a few tools to modify the design. Most of the time I can use the contour tool, which allows you to remove contours or cuts from an image. When you select an image and click on the contour tool in the lower right hand corner, a new window will open on the screen. You will be able to see a preview of the image with the cuts or contours that make up that image. And on the right side of the window, you are going to see a list of the individual pieces that make up that image. When you click on a portion of the design in the preview screen, it will change color on the image and it will be highlighted on the right side in that list of contours and cuts. When you close your window, that portion of the image has been removed from the design. If you wish to return it to the image, you can open up the contour window again and click on that contour or cut that you removed. When you select it once again, the color will change and be returned to the design. When you close the window, the cut or contour has been returned once again to the image. So how can you use this tool to modify an SVG? Here's a design that I'm going to be creating with, but I want to remove a few of the cuts from this design. I'm going to select the image, then click on that contour tool in the lower right corner. In the contour window, I'm going to start selecting the images that I want to remove. I can select them in the preview window or in the list of cuts on the right side of the window. Now these do not go in any specific order, so sometimes you do have to play around and try to figure out which cuts are which. Once all of the contours or cuts have been removed, I can modify the SVG by inserting text or adding images from my image library and create a unique project with this image. Isn't that great? All right, there is your five minute Cricut class. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel. I do have more five minute classes available. You can go ahead and click on that playlist and learn more ways to use your Cricut. If you want to gain more confidence, use that coupon code below to save on my Cricut Basics course. I hope that you have a wonderful week and I can't wait to see what you create.